morning everyone this is Nicole and I want everyone to know I'm okay um, there was a earthquake last night around 7 30 that happened in LA it was in Laverne Laverne is like 20 miles east of downtown LA and I'm south slightly southwest of downtown LA southwest of Huntington Beach and very like 50 miles or so south of Silmar but I'm mentioning those cities because that's where they can feel it so uh, shout out to the radical sister because she just uploaded a video about this and it happened when I was at home I just got home I think around that time I was taking a shower, but I didn't feel anything, um, so I'm okay. I'm gonna play her video, and hopefully it won't get taken down, and I hope she doesn't um, feel any kind of way about me playing her video on my channel, but shout out to her. Please go to her channel and subscribe, and um, I'll come back with, with more because she, uh, has this video up and I'll just let her video play and that'll be it um, thank you for watching uh, please keep us in your prayers and your thoughts but it's clear that the uh, the earth is is changing I'm not too sure if the universe is expanding or condensing it's hard to for me to conceptualize that but I just want everybody to know I'm okay. Um, I hope that, I think Aaron is not near their um, hood mistress is not, I don't think she's near that area either. But it's an area that's near Rancho Cucamonga, Covina. And like I said, it's 4.4 magnitude. So I'm gonna play the Radical Sisters video now. Blessings, family, Sister Ajali. I just, uh, with our family, we just finished morning prayer for the 2.67 billion who are. Oh, oh, thank you, Brother Gab Talk Media. I appreciate that. Um, for the 2.67 billion who are prophesied to snap out of it. I would thereby say, hopefully, it's gonna be many of you who are living on the west coast of this land because you're being spared. I would say humbly, the hand of Allah is on you, but it's as a warning to get out it's not as a warning to just stay there and if i'm of any assistance in that mighty warning i just humbly sit back and say whoa all right um because i i know me <laughs> i am not at all amazed by me you need to be far more amazed by yourself and uh, just the life force that you have and want to do all that's necessary to put in to greater safety. So all that said, there's 21, I, I believe, could be 22 volcanoes all up and down through California. I had no idea. But there's also the San Andreas Fault. And that's one of the biggest faults. It is considered a territory that is along the Ring of Fire. 
that travels all the way down through South America and then all the way up and around the Pacific Ocean in right back on up into Japan and all those uh, all the countries that border the Pacific Ocean they are in a critically vulnerable position in on this planet because that area is just so seismically active. Uh, Step Step Brother says to me that there's no way that the earth is collapsing in on itself, it's expanding. All I know is stuff pops off in that area. And in my very limited understanding of how it works, all of those different tectonic fissures and plates are right there. They're not fused together so that there's no seismic upticks going on over there. They're separate and knowing how just stacking dishes up on a dish drying rack, if you happen to do that, I still do that. Um, And you have too many of them and you pull something out without taking into account all the other plates and dishes something's going to start tumbling down something could get broken um and or with a simple jenga game if you're taking out the wrong peg everything's going to tumble over well there have been so many pegs taken out so that right now the jenga of the west coast is primed to topple over this is just simple physics (laughs) physics <laughs> Jeez. this is, let's just figure right now that the whole west coast is being held up in place by almost air um and i would say that this 4.4 magnitude earthquake is more of a mercy from allah because so many of us live out here so many of us are embedded in these people's you know fantasies about themselves so that you know they play heroes in movies but in real life they're despicable because they're not saying anything about that uh the cores that are in the mantle of the earth which might be give not knowing that might be giving an awful lot of people a false false sense of comfort And so that you're used to life before Fukushima, where you could watch stuff pop off and and you don't think that it's really necessarily connected. Oh, there was an earthquake in Venezuela. Oh, there was one in Vanuta. Oh, you know, there's all sorts of things happening. But the thing is, is there's never been a surge of seismic activity and volcanic eruptions like there's been since Fukushima. And it's only getting worse, right? So this stack of dishes is about to fall down. And the fact that Los Angeles, and and not just Los Angeles, but all of the West Coast is taking such a protracted time to have what other regions are only going to experience even worse themselves. That says definitively that Allah is just saying, okay, I'm giving you some time. Get it together and get out. Right? And there's a get in. Here, Newark is fabulous. I love Newark. And I understand even though the northeastern region has its small smattering of quakes nothing on par with what's going on around the ring of fire all right so newark is beautiful oh just say it with me it's a chocolate city it's luscious you aren't going to really see any ir couples out here unless you know now that i've announced that they'll be targeting newark which i don't want them to do but at the same time we got to be able to speak the truth because these people will do stuff to us no matter what they won't stop so um yeah i highly recommend newark uh i don't know about the other regions but i've heard good things about detroit detroit is really inexpensive compared to newark which is expensive but there's also Baltimore, um, Atlanta. I think they kind of taken over Atlanta with the trap music and the homoism that's off the hook. Um, and, you know, they put up the Bophomedic statue. They sort of know they got Atlanta on the lockdown. Um, and then there's Philadelphia. That's a great place to go. 
any place, any place right now is going to be better than somewhere where there could be a 8.2. Because when those dishes start falling down, all sorts of things get broken. It could be a greater level magnitude earthquake over there than anywhere in all the rest of the ring of fire. So I'll go over this a little bit, but, you know, I know they're only going to give so much information. They always do. So a 4.4 magnitude earthquake shook Southern California about 25 miles east of downtown Los Angeles on Tuesday, just yesterday. But there were no immediate reports of damage or injuries, the U.S. Geological Survey said. The earthquake struck about 7.33 p.m. local time. The U.S. USGS said it was centered about three miles north of the city of La Verne in San Gabriel Valley. It was like if somebody had grabbed it and was shaking a house. Vicky Carrillo of La Verne, who was watching Jaws 2 with her son, told Los Angeles Times, yeah, these people not only play... So I want to, um, I'm going to link this video because I don't want to go on too long. But thank you for watching. You all have a great day and I'll talk to you in the next one.